everybody and welcome back to the channel. I hope everyone's doing well and having a great day. I am back with another SnowRunner video for you guys. Today we're going to be doing a mission called Means of Production. We have to go out and pick up a cargo container that someone else dropped in the river. It's way up here at the north end of the map. We got to go up all the way up to here, pick up a cargo container out of the river with a crane and get it to this sawmill warehouse here. I'm going to be using this truck that I haven't really driven a whole lot, at least not for a while. Azov 73210. It's a 10 wheel drive. It's got, um, it's actually six wheel steering, I think, or is it just the two fronts? No, see how all four fronts and the two rear ones steer. It's because it's so long, such a long wheelbase. If it didn't do that, it would have a miserable turning radi radius. But it actually does pretty good. And from what I remember, it's a fairly capable truck, so... We shouldn't have a problem getting over there. Oops, let's put that in auto. There we go. I've just been laying here, sipping on my coffee and playing SnowRunner. Didn't play a whole lot today. I played a little bit. Finished up a mission earlier that I had started before. I didn't video that one. I can't remember the name of it. gotten some positive comments and quite a few subscribers recently it's been a week or so now but somebody shared one of my videos on a snow runner group on reddit and I literally like doubled my subscribers or more just in a day and a half or whatever thought that was really cool I just wanted to say thanks again guys I really appreciate all the new subscribers and all the comments I've gotten you know a few comments here and there not a whole lot but quite a few and they are all appreciated every one of them were positive too so I must be doing halfway decent and making these editing these videos I have fun doing it that's for sure I I'm in the right mood for it even the editing, like, sometimes I do it and it's just a chore and I don't feel like doing it. I don't want to do it. Other times, I, I really enjoy it. The actual playing and making the videos I enjoy. Getting a little more comfortable on camera. That's always been a problem since I started doing these videos. Never been very comfortable in front of the camera. love those little warning cracks the ice gives you like oh you're getting too close to the edge here buddy about to go through the ice
Left this line down, getting over here to this main road. By far the quickest way over here. Driving this truck kind of reminds me of driving the KRS Bandit. It's actually one of my favorites. That one's eight wheel drive and all four front tires. It's got four front and four rear and all four front ones steer, but none of the rears do. And it's quite a bit shorter than this truck is. I like the Bandit better because it's got a little more clearance and more articulation in the suspension. This one doesn't give you that sensation of like where the chassis is getting all twisted up and articulating. It stays fairly level. And it's fun, more fun to drive, but it tips over easier too. Without a doubt. I was doing this video just a few minutes ago. Got all the way over to the cargo box or cargo container. And the nurse came in. And... She came in to do my vitals and bring me some medicine and stuff. And I didn't want it in my video, and I'm pretty sure she doesn't want to be in the video, so I just dropped the container back in the river and recovered the truck to the garage to start over. Went and deleted what little bit of video there was. Twenty minutes or whatever it took me to get over here. Fifteen minutes. Just deleted it and started over. Seems like I got over here a lot quicker this time. It was more like 15 minutes getting over here and getting the thing loaded getting it out of the river. This small crane's not the best for loading the heavier cargo, like the cargo container. It'll do it, but it don't like it. Get over here, you son of a bitch. This truck doesn't like these dips in the asphalt. Bang, 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 bottoming out. Let's put it in low three. Swing it wide. See what I mean? Seriously bottoming out. Slow this down. This part right here is really steep. I know a lot of you guys like third person view, so I'll get you some of that. I like both. Thought it would look cool coming down this little steep part from the front. Just kind of creeping, crawly, creepy crawling down it.
hope I can get it from here. I dropped it a little farther towards the other bank. On accident. Let's try that. Activate anchor. Skip the screen. Barely. Got it. That's so cool. What a great shot right there.
think we picked a great truck to do this mission. I mean, I think I picked a great truck to do this mission. Bam. Remember how bad it is over near the drop off area. Seems like it was a ton of mud and water. This one in low three. Come on, girl.
Maybe if I get up here. Get around. Son of a bitch. Depth perception was off a little because of the angle. Ah, we're cooking. Sucker over there. I run out of record time. Well guys, that's about it for this video. I wanted to do another shorter one. The last few I've done have been really long. I still got to upload them. I think there's two or three that I've done that were pretty long. And I'll be uploading those real soon. I really appreciate you guys. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And please leave a like, leave a comment, share the video. And if you haven't already, please consider subscribing. I hope everyone has an awesome day. And I will see you on the next one.